Formosan Strait. The crew of a Chinese fishing junk were invited to go aboard one of Chiang Kai-shek's warships for a general get-together, an invitation all the more welcome as it included a meal. This and other men of war patrol the strait between Formosa and the mainland of China, though there has so far been no apparent sign of Peking wanting to lift a finger against Chiang's island. Of small importance in itself, the goodwill gesture perhaps indicated a revival of Chiang Kai-shek's ambition to invade China and seize power. For any such move, friends on the mainland would be valuable. To Formosa, the Japanese gave thriving industry and agriculture during the half century they possessed the island before their defeat in World War II. Today, Formosa has an up-to-date shipbuilding industry. Its main customer, the United States. On the stocks when these films were taken, a 36,000-ton tanker, a dollar-earning gesture of America's friendship. Peking, China's friendship until recently was with Soviet Russia. Khrushchev visited China while he was still in power to sign with Mao Zedong a Russo-Chinese Treaty of Peace. Now the world's two biggest communist countries are at loggerheads. Formosa, many in Chiang's army believe that now is the chance for which they've waited 20 years. But Generalissimo Chiang himself is now 80. It's unlikely that the army will get much further than their annual parade. Milton Key, 